Hello everyone, welcome to our channel and that is Double Click Academy, your ultimate online lessons. Today, realize we are basically going to look at that is how to create a folder and saving a file in that folder. So before we do that, please click and subscribe to our channel so that you'll be in position to always get any update that we post into our channel and that will empower your learning capacities. Now, so for your ultimate computer online lessons, follow us on YouTube and make sure that you subscribe and give thumbs up to Double Click Academy. With that, we realize we are going to start up by first of all creating a folder. Now, how do we create a folder? We create a folder by just clicking anywhere outside the, I mean, on the on top of the desktop. Don't click where there is any icon. Just click where there is a free space, and with it, we only right click. And right clicking is clicking on the right hand click of the of the mouse so we are going to right click that is right clicking and with that we have all these options but we are interested only in the new because when you point at new it will give you another opening that is where you can see things like folder shortcut and the rest but we are interested in the folder so we shall click on the folder and with the folder it gives us this other icon this is a folder icon with the word new folder in blue and we shall now remove those words. How do we remove those words? We remove the words by either you starting to type the name of the folder you want or you backspace and then start typing it afresh. So we, you are starting with typing the name already which is maybe double click double click academy. Assuming that is the name of our folder double click academy too because we already have a double click academy here so we don't want to make it a, a, the same name it will not accept so we have to just put it and then we press the enter key now after pressing the enter key your folder is already created and this is our folder now the folder is already created then we can now open up any file that we want to work on assuming we want to work on word excel or whichever kind of file you want to work on we shall now open up that file and we can get the files from this microsoft icon which is of start click on it and when you click on it it gives you all this Maybe you can also type as a shortcut form, assuming you want a word, we can just type here word, and a, a word icon is there, that is word up, it's here, then we shall click on it, and then it will open, it's now opening, our word document is now opening, it will open, and here we are, you realize you already have one here, assuming we didn't have it complete, it will now just create our new one, Maybe by just coming to these other icons here. This is a word icon, this is PowerPoint, and so many others. So, assuming you know what you're doing, you shall just open, double click on this, and it will open like this. Now, this is, you're now opening a new word document, which is here, blank document. So, our interest is on a blank document, we shall click on this, and then a blank word document is opening. On top here, you're seeing it's document one, but we can rename it and save it into our folder. Maybe we want to name it and say how to start word document. So that is the name of the document. Maybe you can now type that as the word, word document. And there are two ways to save it into our folder. There is this one, which is a shortcut form. There, or we can just come to file here. Then we come to save us. Whichever way you will take, it will take you there. So assuming we are taking this one of file, we shall click on file. Then we come to save us here. We click on save us. From save us, it will now show you where exactly you want to save it. In this, on OneDrive, in this PC, in add place or browse. So we are going to browse because we are interested in the desktop. So we shall click on browse and then browse will take us to it's now bringing us to this PC documents and the rest. But we are not interested in that. We are interested in the desktop. So we just come to this pc and the desktop desktop is here so we shall click on the desktop and then it will show us all the folders that are in our desktop then we now choose the folder name we created was double click academy so we shall now double click on this double click academy and a double click academy comes on top here we didn't have any other documents saved in double click then after that we shall now come to file name here from here is showing doge one doge one means document one but that's not the name we want to give to our file we want to give our file maybe a name opening word document opening word document so that is 
the word or the title we want to give to our file. So when we save it, you shall now go to the double click academy folder and we shall see this as our file name. So after that, we shall now save and there it has already saved. So we can now close this and then we go to our double click academy folder we created. When we double click on it as a way of opening, we shall double click on it and then it opens with that file name of Word, I mean opening Word document. So that is basically that how you open up your, I mean how you create your folder and save a file into that folder. So thank you so much for tuning in and please subscribe. Make sure that you subscribe to our channel so that you'll be receiving the subsequent videos as well.